Who is Katherine Johnson? Katherine Johnson was born in West Virginia on August 26, 1918. At an early age, she showed a great talent for math. However, where Katherine lived, African American children were only educated until 8th grade. Here's a quick history lesson. Segregated, when a group or groups of people are kept apart from each other. In this case, African American and white people were being kept apart in schools. Integrating, to remove segregation. In this case, it means African American and white people were educated at the same places. Most places of education in the United States were segregated. In 1938, a law was passed that each state had to offer African American people the same educational opportunities as white people. They could do this either by building universities just for African Americans or by integrating their current universities. What is Katherine Johnson known for? In 1953, Katherine started working in the computing section of NASA. The people working in Katherine's section were known as computers because of their rapid ability to do complex calculations. When Katherine began working for NASA, African American people were treated as if they were not equal. The section Catherine worked in was segregated. Only African American people worked there. Even the restrooms and eating areas were segregated. However, Catherine led the way in showing what women and African American people could achieve. Catherine Johnson's work included looking at information from flights, working out why things may have gone wrong, and making suggestions on how to improve things. She worked on the Freedom 7 project when Alan Shepard became the first American to go into space. Catherine performed calculations to help work out when spacecraft should be launched in order to make them land in the right place. In recognition of the work carried out by Johnson and her colleagues, Dorothy Vaughn and Mary Jackson, a film was created called Hidden Figures in 2016. Fun facts about Katherine Johnson. In the 1950s, the United States and Russia began to compete in a space race. Katherine was asked to use her amazing math skills for different calculations and research. She plotted the path for America's first human space flight in 1961. This was a huge responsibility because if her calculations were wrong, the astronauts could have died. During her successful career with NASA, Catherine co-wrote 26 papers and calculated paths for space shuttles and emergency return directions. In 2015, Catherine Johnson was awarded the Presidential Medal of Freedom by Barack Obama. This medal is given to people who have helped America progress in the world. In 2016, a building at NASA was named after her, and Catherine received a Silver Snoopy Award. This award is given to those who have made an outstanding contribution to flight safety and mission success. Catherine Johnson died on February 24, 2020. She led the way for women and African Americans in the fields of space and mathematics. That's all for now. For more information and resources related to Katherine Johnson, head to twinkle.com.